happening this midday in Mid-South neighborhood and community mourning the deaths of four people. Thanks for joining us this midday. I'm Caitlin Lockerbie. John Paul has the day off. A deadly fire in Collierville claimed the lives overnight. Three of them teenagers, the other an adult. This happened in the home in the 600 block of Autumn Winds Road off Bahalia Road around 11 o'clock last night. Local 24 News reporter Brad Broders is live in the neighborhood. Brad. Caitlin, the Collierville Fire Chief said the three teenagers who died inside this home were staying here because their parents were out of the country on a mission trip. We're also told a neighbor and police officer rushed inside before the fire trucks arrived, but their efforts were unsuccessful. Here's also what we know this midday. According to Collierville Fire leaders, at this point, it's unclear what started the fire last night, which caused significant damage and again killed four people. The fire chief said the mother who lived at the home and three teenagers died. We are told firefighters were able to rescue one child and one adult. That adult went to the Regional One Burn Center. The child went to the LeBonner Children Burn Center. This morning, the Collierville Mayor Stan Joyner shared his thoughts. It's horrible. Uh, obviously, our hearts go out to the, to the families and to the neighbors. Uh, I know it's a traumatic situation for all that are involved. Can't say how sorry we are for the loss of life. Now, again, four people were killed. Two others were injured after this fire last night here in this Collierville neighborhood. Authorities have not released the identities of those who died, but we have confirmed through Collierville fire leaders that the family who lived here did attend Collierville Bible Church. We'll have more details as we get them beginning at 5, live on local Memphis. Reporting live in Collierville, Brad Broder's Local 24 News.